Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Justin Lin here at Rehab Revive Physical Therapy where we rehab your mind to revive your body. We know that massage guns have been great for helping those who have aches and pains, but did you know it can help deepen your poses for yoga and increase your stretches? We're gonna talk about that next, but first, please like and subscribe to our channel. All right, in order to start and practice the use of this video, you're gonna need a handy dandy massage gun. We use the Ake The Wave Massage Gun Pro. It's great and highly recommended. If you don't have one yourself, we'll link this below in the descriptions. But in general, the rule of thumb is just to move from the center of your body out. So if we're gonna pick a targeted muscle, today we're gonna to use the tricep and the calf. We wanna check that out. You just wanna go from pretty simple, just from center out. So let's just take your generic, very generic. Some people are trying to do this thing, right? But my, my right, especially this top, you can see not very good. So what we're gonna do is we like to stretch that tricep, stretch that shoulder a little bit. I'm gonna start with the soft head here and then we'll move towards the flat head, but you just wanna move it from closest to your body and you wanna move it out. So if this tricep is the target, that's what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna keep running it in that direction. You don't wanna blast it both ways. Just one direction is all you need to do. I'm trying to relax it. You're just trying to lengthen it even more. So it's something we've discovered via these principles. Right there. So you're gonna do this. We're gonna run this for, you know, 10, 15 times. And we'll see if there's big change. I expect there to be. Good. Good. Do a few more times. Just relaxing, getting deeper into your poses or stretches. Makes a big difference. So let's take that and then just tell you I can go a little bit further already. Just a little bit more mobility. Now we're gonna move towards that flat head. So there it is. Let's do that. So I'm gonna switch out the, the head. Give that a shot. Just make sure I don't pop anybody in the eye. Come on. Oh. I've shot a, a few gun, handguns before. All right, here we go. Same thing, I don't like the high settings. You can get there as, as much as you want, but personally, I just kind of go right there. So take a look at that. Let's see here. I can tell you it's a whole lot easier. I can I can move my my shoulder shoulder blade back a little further. So they're a great little little thing. You can do it to different body parts. All right, we're gonna apply the same principle, and we're gonna move it through from top down. So let's go and check something like downward dog or calf stretch. Some of you guys do. So let's do this appropriately here go through here and then I'm gonna go here and this is basically my baseline um, pretty tight I would say the left side has a little bit more right here um, and so if you're feeling this and you got one right around here you can just use that and then kind of give yourself some prep so it's just top down go all the way down to your heel And ideally, we're doing both sides. We're gonna do this, we're gonna run this five or six times. You do this also sitting. And we'll get right into the flat head a little bit. Also, don't forget the inside one. So you wanna get the inside part of your calf. Just go one direction, once again, just like the tricep. I'll get it right here. There we go. We'll do one leg first and then the other. Good, I'll get to the flat head.
All right. So we're gonna get air in all here, and we're gonna get right into here. Oh yeah, that's money. That feels a whole lot better. A lot of you guys, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm gonna angle myself a little bit. Um, we're getting this nice little crease here where this one doesn't have that. So we're gonna we're gonna do that other one. We're gonna do the right one pretty soon. All right, let's start that again. All right, let's do the other one. I believe the longer you do, the deeper it can get, deeper your poses, especially for you yogis out there. Just wanna perform better, have more flexibility, good. All right, I'm gonna move over to the flathead. baseline check here so all right so we're gonna do this again get up in here and then i like that it feels good much better good just a matter of a few minutes there we go pretty good and we're back Hopefully you see that there's changes in your downward dog or even simple things like a pectoral stretch. You can apply this method and this strategy to just about any stretch, any yoga pose, if you just wanna lengthen. So make sure you do it to the appropriate muscle. Check with your healthcare practitioner, make sure that this is safe for you. And if you have any comments or feedback, leave those in the comment box below. We would love your continued support. Please subscribe to our channel, leave these guys, I'm Dr. Lin. Remember, we heal smarter, not harder.